All right, what's going on, guys? My name is Sunbot2018, and welcome back to Dying Light 2, Stay Human. Um, we're just going to continue on. we got to head to Old Villador, head back to the bazaar. We stumbled upon Matt's stuff. He's trying to take the uh, car factory. Uh, I'm tired. <laughs> Still early in the morning. So uh, why am I all the way down here again? Uh, I, I seriously need to find my player stash. I need to fucking see what else has been put in there for me. Well, I'm back in old Villador, so there's that. <laughs> There's bridges here now. These weren't fucking here before, were they? Nope, these are 100% were not here before. Wait, can I search that? I can lockpick it. Can I find a gun? Find leather. <laughs> we'll say that's the one thing that this game is completely different from the first one. The lack of fucking firearms. So then again, the fucking humanity has fallen. Everybody's using melee weapons. So yeah. All I have to do now is to get all the way to Old Villador. Don't go across this way anymore. Geronimo! Uh. You shut up over there. Nobody gives a shit. Nobody loves you. You suck. Oh, great. What if I try killing that anomaly? Howlers is what they're called. But it's never asleep right now in the night. It's very, uh, unusual. I like a Ryan. I don't think we got her last name. Fuck around, please. Okay, guess we can't fight a fucking anomaly yet. What's detecting me? Ow. That shit's firing at me. Why are you firing at me? Why are you being a dick? Alright, 
Yeah, no, fuck it. There's too many howlers in the area and I don't want to get chased. Fuck. Ow, you dick. Oh, it's some yeah, shit. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're running. off you I keep telling everyone we should be getting ready for winter yeah great where the fuck this doctor you know while since I've been here so hooray That costs a lot. It costs even more. What's the craft master? She said they didn't you up at first. Hello, she's looking for something more. They took all the equipment. Can you hear yourself at all? Maybe that quick. Just like me. You can fix it by figuring out how you're going to pay me back. And quick. Well, since we're here, let's check our fucking player stash. Hello, I got a level 5 fucking thing. But maybe this will cause the thing to stop. Search the bazaar for. Oh, okay, I guess I just gotta talk to people. He's far too easily offended. And hey, he's been around a while. Yeah, fine Well, that didn't fucking go in my favor. My best bet would be that they're up here. Stop somewhere. Let's give it some time. Maybe both our kids will grow up a little and then we'll see. Over here.
What is in my player stash? I've already searched. The thing's gonna keep popping up, and I don't know what the fuck. What's up, Barney? Long time no see. Hello, Barney. What brings you, pal? Mm. How's life? Better? Now that the PK finally stopped bothering us. I'm even thinking of starting my own business. I know a bit about weapon design. I could start making and selling them. Sounds good. Yeah. And uh, how's Sophie doing? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's major news. She's the big boss now. <laughs> I'm sure she is. After all that happened, folks finally realized we needed a real leader. I'd say things have turned out the way they always should have been. Well, good for her. And for all of old Villador. Sweet. I'm looking for Dr. Veronica Ryan. You're not the only one, man. What do you mean? The good doctor's in trouble. And, uh, weird kind of trouble. You see, a group of renegades appeared in old Villador. First, we braced ourselves for another battle. But they didn't attack the bazaar. Just asked for Dr. Ryan. Of course, we didn't tell them where she is. And where is Veronica? <laughs> you can tell me, right? In a hideout. Vincenzo and a few of our people are protecting her there. But the less people know about that place, the safer she is. Where is it, Barney? If the renegades are hunting Veronica, a few people may not be enough. You just can't walk away from a fight, can you? The building is north of Quarry End. Courtesan Rose Street. But you didn't hear it from me. And you? Why are you here and not with Vincenzo and the rest? I wanted to be, but Sophie talked me out of it. Said something about not wanting them to have to deal with my attitude. What attitude, for fuck's sake? This one? I have no idea. Okay. Thanks for the info. I'll go and give him a hand. The folks say I'm the one always itching for a fight. Anyway, good luck, man. Glad to know we're on uh, good terms. Uh, I am definitely gonna. Wait a minute, I answer through here, right? Oh. Feel stupid now. What do we buy? What do we have already? Uh, we could buy some rank four stuff. Two-handed weapons. I already have something of that. Well, I'm completely fucking broke. But with all the shit I have. Hey! Dude, I should look kind of badass with that. Let's actually let's sell a couple more things. Where the hell did I get you from? Huh. Didn't notice that earlier. Let's go. Wait, can I get any extra weapons? Uh, let's go ahead and let's put one of those high tech weapons up here. Let's add a bit of shocking onto them. Oh, repair the weapon a bit.
This is a two-handed weapon. Hmm. Oh, whoops. Okay. Let's head on out. It's about to be daytime too, so. Sometimes I wake up at night and forget the fall even happened. That's about the only time I smile. Then I. Yeah. All the way down there, huh? Oh boy. Start killing more renegades. That was lavender for. There we go. the roof somehow. Luckily I have a grappling hook that can help me get up there. Oh, I'm not in the right area anyway. Oh shit, that almost fucking screwed me over. Okay. So now I have an actual sprint instead of just jogging. Move. When I come after me, come out in the sunlight. Vampirish looking motherfuckers. <laughs> Boo! That didn't work. Hi! Ah, 
bitch. Where'd you go? How good are these hospital braces? Damn it! There's a brain in here to cut his brain out. Thank God. Wait, where's Veronica? She managed to escape. I need to find her. Do you know where she is now? No. But we can try to contact her. Veronica? Veronica? Are you safe? Veronica. <sighs> Shit. Something's not right. Yes. I'm safe. Are you? Oh, I am now. There is someone who needs to speak to you. Yeah, Dr. Ryan, I'm Aiden. I know that you're being hunted by the renegades. Hurry, Aiden. More renegades may be here any minute. Juan Rainer, he told me you worked for the GRE. I need access to the GRE database in the observatory. I, I have a GRE key. A GRE access key? That's what I've been told. You think you can... Let's meet. I'll be in a small building near the dam, not far from the observatory. Great. Okay, I'll go... Wait, hello? Be careful, Aiden. The place is soaked in chemicals. I will. Thanks for the heads up, Vincenzo. Thank you. I'm lucky you showed up. Farewell, Aiden. Farewell. Uh, you make it sound like I'm not gonna ever see you again, buddy. Right, back up we go.
Hi, bud. Hey, bud. There. I think they blocked it off trying to keep me in. Aiden, you're probably on your way to meet Veronica Ryan now, but I figured it out, baby. Figured what out? Matt's reloaded the load. He must have more trains. And he's operating somewhere in old Villador. You're paranoid, Juan. You see conspiracies everywhere. I know you're going to Veronica. But if Matt is shooting the moon yet again, if he attacks the dam, Williams will force the chemicals to burst from the ground. You realize that? It will kill everything and everyone. You, me, Veronica Ryan, and your beloved sister as well. You understand? Help me. Fine. If I agree, what would I do? We don't have any antennas in old Villador. That's why Matt disappeared from the radar. But there is one on the chimney of the electrical substation. Adjust it to the right frequency, and we'll find the place from which the attack will launch. Leave the rest to me. Okay. I'll see. Aiden, this is a matter of life and death. Don't let me down. That's side quest, thank god. We'll do that side quest later. But, it's an important side quest. Uh, this one's number five. Deals with the devil. I just want to do this one right now. I do not. Right. money off these people. Oh, hi. I know we're just gonna have to ignore that. So I've, I keep looking at my player stash and I don't see anything that's worth my time. You shit. Let's fuck this. We got 
You guys attacked me first. I'm just going out and about. Minding my own fucking business. You're on your own, lady. This is covered in chemicals. Small break, catch your breath. Hello there. I remember climbing something like this before. Wasn't this the tower where I first, uh, I think this is the one where I first met Luan or something like that. Yeah, I think it is. Okay, the antenna's working. Ah, oh, thank God. I knew you'd smarten up. Wait a sec. I was right. The signal is weak, but I can clearly see it's coming from somewhere. Can you go and check this place out? Oh, God. Sure. Just a leisurely stroll, really. It's fucking paranoid as hell. Yay! Oh, this is gonna kill me. I jumped way too low. 
Jumped way too low. Way too low. I died. Damn it. <laughs> I jumped way too low. And I keep sprinting by accident. Hello, I'm here now. I'm not in a PK camp, am I? I am. Oh man, it would have been a great fucking like glide right all the way over there. Bitch, ah. Ah. Hey. You're, Let's end this. You're welcome. Ah, damn, man. Ow. What the hell hit me? Fucking goddamn infected. Oh shit. Is there like another type of skill? Okay, I thought you were a person for a minute, but that's cool. I seems to get stuck darting. Now that I have darting a lot, I'm actually wasting a lot of my stamina. Looks like I could... It seems as though there's a path here. Oh, fuck off there, buddy. If I just steer safe, what the fuck's going on with that one? This is in there. And then the anomaly. Here we go. Ugh. All right, sorry, Matt. They strung me up. Hope someone helps, BK. Oof. He has to be careful because the butchers are back nothing. Let's see. Fucking renegade. He's late. If you only knew, Gadjo. Daniel is gonna die any second sitting in this shithole. Luckily, you got a shit ton of UV lamps now. <laughs> I work hard for them. Where is that fucker? Jack's getting impatient. Brew him some fucking chamomile. Juan, Dan Yor's here. I saw him earlier at the Peacekeeper's HQ. They're talking about the, some kind of transaction. Apparently William's man is supposed to meet them. Son of a gun. Don't lose the maiden. So, 
Matt's got an inn with the renegades? It seems that way. And that inn will be here any minute. The lamps went to the middleman. You have to attend that meeting, Aiden. Don't lose them. Listen to what they say. It's damned important. I believe God. He's doing the bad that is all. Great. Until today, I thought our chances against renegades were pretty good. You're finally here. <sighs> Fucking idiots. That was fucked. Steve. First, one of the guards stops me, asks me where I'm going, so I tell his dumbass I'm going to see my girl. <laughs> then he gives me this, like, brain dead look and says, Hey, haven't you heard that someone's killing our men in the camps? <laughs> our best officers. So then I'm thinking, Oh man, I'm staying put. Then a sec later, I hear, Nobody would want to kill you. <laughs> Go wherever you want. Okay. So let's take a look at the lamps. <laughs> Alrighty, my friend. Wife. I'm just cooking together. Think you're a go? Whoa, 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 whoa. Something's wrong. What the hell is going on here? Damn it! How am I supposed to get across if he's fucking right there, dude? Maybe there's a way I can fucking sneak past him, because I I have a feeling if I try and go that way, I'm gonna get fucking caught. Catch you stealing, you lose a hand, pal. God. So I could have gone this way. I didn't fucking want to take the chance because what if I fucking got caught? I'm still gonna get fucking caught. You can see me, then why the fuck are you doing shit, dipshit? Too fucking pissed off to deal with your shit. You, you face the other way. Yeah, you walk that way. What do you have, what else do you have to say? I'm already almost out of time. So now talk. When's the transport to the dam heading out? When, when, um, oh, so like, when I get the signal. When I get the signal. Does Matt pay you for shitty information like that? Told you, command doesn't tell me shit. I'm just a driver. Oh, fine. Inform us when you start to move out. Then we'll pack the surprise inside. Going down even further. One. Seems there's gonna be some kind of transport to the Colonel. The PK are gonna plant something in it. Shit. They're gonna send him a bomb or something? Fuck! Huh? Who's there? Uh, hello? Damn, he heard me. Chase him down. Fuck me. He cannot get away, is that clear? Great, now I don't gotta be silent no more. Now it's just a matter of chasing. Ah, shit! Open, fucker! Got him? No. If he gets away, it'll ruin everything. Where you fuck? Stop! I'm not gonna hurt you. Who the hell are you? Whoa, peace, brother. Peace and forgiveness. I just tried stuff. The butcher sent you. Colonel Butcher. Yeah, <laughs> but I like peacekeepers and bizarre dudes <laughs> and nomads. I like everybody, really. You too, man. <laughs> I love you. Okay. Hey, I got him. Some joker named Steve. What should I do? <laughs> Steve. I know him. Matt Roach would sell his own mother. Don't kill him. We can make a deal with the worm. Hey! Who you call it a worm? Push him. Ask what he's doing for Matt. First, he'll tell me what I want to know. Waltz, where is he? I, I don't know. I avoid that psycho like toxic waste. Won't get within 10 feet of his quarters. So he's in the Colonel's stronghold. Yeah, yeah, he's got his own rooms. Probably a lab for doing some weird shit. Jabbing renegades with monster serum and whatnot. What? Uh, I'd rather sleep in virals than go in there, man. 
What are you supposed to bring to the stronghold? You think I know? I don't, man. They don't tell me shit, man. And if they do, I forget it anyway. Got memory troubles? Told you, I'm just a driver. That's all I remember. What is your deal with Matt? You mean you... you're not with the PK? Oh, fuck. Uh, uh, so I'll tell Matt. I'll tell him you were asking questions. You're fucked. <laughs> and I'll tell the Colonel you do deals with the peacekeepers. Great idea. Um, um, uh, you won't do that, will you? <laughs> oh, I'm fucked either way, aren't I? Finally got something right. Oh, okay, fine. Matt wanted a lift. I mean, was supposed to drive him, his men, to William Stronghold. That's all. Matt promised me asylum. Asylum and crystals. If you throw in some weed, we're even, bro. And nobody's the wiser. You dig? What about I don't give you shit or kill you, and you keep your mouth shut, okay? Yeah, sounds good. <laughs> You're all right, man. I knew pilgrims would be cool. Now fuck off. Hey, Juan. Steve told me what he knew. Wait. Not over the radio. Let's meet at the fish eye. How am I supposed to meet you? As soon as you can make it. I'm here waiting for you. How am I supposed to meet you back at the fucking fish eye? I have no way of getting there. Let's do that. Fuck. It's just taking too damn long. How about I meet with Veronica for fucking. Thank you. This is a fucking side quest, man. A goddamn side quest. Why is this fucking taking so damn long? Is there a way I can fast travel? I can't fast travel. Let's see how quickly I can get there and get all this shit done. It's afterwards I gotta fast travel back. Come on, why are you going so slow? I'm literally almost out of time. I gotta see if I can get there quick enough. What's my phone key going off? Why did that hurt me? Ah, uh. uh, shit. Give me a sec. All right, here we go. All right, tell so, me what you have. You know Matt's deal yet? Yeah, pretty much. Although Steve could barely remember his name. Jack's plan is simple. 
He wants to use the transport to get his men inside the stronghold. Just as I thought. He plans to take the dam before Williams can shut the floodgates and drown the city. But, yeah, you mentioned that, but you meant open the floodgates and drown the city, right? I meant what I said. When he shuts the gates, groundwater levels will rise. And with it, all the chemical shit soaked in the ground. We're gonna be like Venice, if Venice was a damp, toxic, plague-infested hell. Anyway, Matt seems ready to take the risk to get into the stronghold and take the dam before the shit hits the fan. Your Trojan horse. Makes sense. It's Russian roulette, Aiden. And at least five chambers contain bullets. One wrong move and we're all dead. All right, so what's your plan? There are people in the Peacekeepers who think logically. And they know that to take the stronghold, Matt's willing to drag us all to the grave. We'll present the evidence about what Matt is doing now. And what he did 11 years ago, when he killed half the city. What's your plan? I've tracked down one of the Renegade officers. One who knows the truth. The truth? He was in Matt's squad that day. He saw Matt receive the order to evacuate. We need to get him to testify during the trial. He's a renegade, Juan. No one on that ship will listen to him. We have to try. The more witnesses and accounts we have, the more likely that people will put two and two together. Unless Jack has us hanged first. Relax. If I play it right and accuse him publicly, he wouldn't dare touch me. And I won't let him touch you. But I need you to meet that renegade. I have to stay put so Matt doesn't get suspicious. Find the guy and bring him in. I'll prepare to trigger a mutiny. Jack likes law and order. Let's give him a highly public trial and have him hang for his crimes. Oh, fucking Christ. Yeah, how about fuck that and we're done with this. We're fucking finish this side quest another time. I'm all out of fucking time, dude. So we're gonna fucking finish the side quest some other time. I'm gonna meet with Veronica, then we'll meet the fucking renegade. Just all this shit's fucking taking too damn long. Alright. With all that said and done, that's the end of this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, because I know for a fact I did. And as always, I will see you guys in another one of my videos. Alright. Bye bye, everybody.